Let's just say we open up and there's sixty two thousand four hundred and sixty seven dollars in there. What would you do? Now we get to see what's in it. Team, we break cuddle. We're gonna do the Route 77 Red RG3. I got two words for you. What they call me? It's been a while since I came to this place here. 283, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 is one of my favorite numbers. If you all pay attention to my videos, I say it all the time. But we take them and put them in one digit, so that's a four. Fours are good numbers. We're about to do this. Uh, shout out to my outfit of the day. I uh, always look like this, completely like a, a, almost like a dang bum. But that's what pirates are. Pirates dress like this. We don't need to worry about... Fancy clothes, Gucci shoes, all quick, clean cut. We're pirates. Pirates look clean. Let's get started. Why did I buy this unit right here? Now, I bought this unit the other day as well when I was on Thrift, Thrift Trader. Sorry, Thrift Trader. I was on your live video and we went and did the zip code thing. There was two units. That, there were several on there and I was out of merchandise. This is another one I bought on there. 50 bucks. They had very kind of piss poor photos so to speak but it looked business like you saw this right here one two three four five six seven eight that's 20 to 30 bucks in chairs i paid 50 for this unit looked very business oriented but i saw this right here and this thing right here what made me think okay this might not be more than might be more than just business stuff you saw the football pad but here's things that doesn't make sense when they took the video or the photos why wasn't this in the photo We're not gonna open this right now. We're going to save this till the end. It's taped up. That doesn't mean nothing locks off, but we're gonna build some suspense here. So, other reasons why I bought this. Obviously the box screen, something more than just business-like stuff. Business units very go for very little. You saw the files and everything here, paperwork. People don't wanna do that work. They think there's not gonna be some gold miner treasure, but for 50 bucks, I think we're going to make something off this unit. What, I don't know yet, because we're gonna do this unboxing now, but right there, chairs worth a few bucks. There was the black case I saw in the photos online, the DeWalt, the Total Body Gym, that's always a few bucks. And yeah, so let's get started. Okay. Earplugs, these are great. These are dual earplugs. These are great when you work with your uncle and he talks a lot and says kind of really uh, bold statements and things like that and you wanna block them out. You get a box of these and every day you go to work, you got a new one. Those are perfect. Shout out to Uncle Michael, we're gonna need those. When you buy a storage unit, you must have vision. You must be able to see and believe there's something in there with your vision. Because why? Why is that? Because life is full of opportunity. Sometimes the opportunity is broken, but nonetheless, there is opportunity and you can persevere. This is great for garage sales, um, home open sign. That means there's a house that's available. We should look into that. files what kind of business are we doing home loans can you guys hook us up Ooh, files oh files Great. what do we have here we have clothes shorts these will fit michael this will fit you mm-hmm these will fit me. Uh -huh. That's cute. No let up. That is the mo motto I have for life right now. We ain't letting up. Hmm, it's got things with tags on it. Handmade classes. What is that? Hood life. That might be a keeper for you. Money, cars, and jewels. You know who I'm. You know who might like that? I'm you. gonna see if he likes that. Who do you think I would give this to? Alex. Boom. We're saving that for Alex. We got Alex a present. Alex, Alex don't watch been getting a heck of gifts lately. Alex, don't watch the video. You're going to know we gave it to you. Way to shop. That's my new shirt right there. Whew. Customer appreciation. Oh, those are actually pretty cute. They're a little big. And they're a little big. Mm, that's fine. More clothes. More clothes. More clothes. Not good clothes. Some Nike golf shoes. Total gym. Totally personal paperwork. This ain't personal. A five dollar vice clamp. clamp. It is and a vice. That is the right word. Ten dollars in 
What are these, girl? Car jacks. And um, like three bucks in tools. Those things. Ooh, we got court shoes. Oh, I see some Gucci shoes. You're not. They're just regular decent court shoes. They need to go to court. Good chair. It's wickerish. Wickerish. 30, 40 bucks. What have we got here? Whew, I'm so glad it's not a cowboy shirt. I'm not. That's a very cowboy ish. But I like it. It's too big for you. Stop saying things are too big for me. Baby girl, you're a little tiny child. I'll grow. No, I won't. You're a young lady. I'm done growing. Walt, it's a belt sander or flat sander type of sander. I said it was probably a little grinder. That's 15, 20 bucks right there. We have a cushion. Where does that go? It's for the chair. It goes with the chair. Thank you. Can you put that there? Oh, score. Score one for the household. We got, ooh, what's that? A kilo? Yeah. Let's report that to the authorities. Definitely. We have a nice little cabinet, the $8 cabinet. I like $8 cabinets. You know why? Yeah. Because they're better than $7 cabinets. Personal paperwork. <laughs> Shoes. We can fill this box up with more celebrity stuff. Ooh, fake stuff. Classic silverware. We have here a six dollar tool set. Oh, it's not five dollar tool set. Why? Because it's not complete. It's just not a good tool set. It's okay, paper, two phones. No one even uses phones like that anymore. Five or ten bucks. What do we have here? Well, the police say they were selling jewelry, and in here is a box of china, gold filled, eighteen karat gold, low end, expensive jewelry. Low-end expensive jewelry? Yeah, low-end expensive jewelry. I don't want to ask for the moon. But I would like to come up. That's sellable. Cassette tapes. Ooh, personal. Hashtag, we're taking the personal trophies. Okay, Coach Sherman. We'll turn that. Cassette tapes, another sellable box. Ooh, what do we got here? T-shirts? Let's see. Like 80,000 of them. Uh, I wish there was 80,000. 80,000 to 50 cents a piece would be 40,000 in shirts. That would be a bad buy for 50. I thought it said gambling tigers. <laughs> was he a grambling coach? Grambling is a college, I think. Grambling University. Those could be a few bucks each. Come on, Mont Blanc pins. Ooh. We've got a tool. That's a decent one. What Keep it. That? You'll need it. I think you need it more than I do. Why? Because you're, uh, you're my worker. Yeah, but you've been cutting the boxes open with that one like, like, it, for the past like, two years. This is a swear jar. Tips. Of course. No tips left in there. We got a lot to do and. Grambling State University, boom. That's exactly what he was. A coach for the Grambling State University at one time. So we want to find something. The People's Network. That's a kind of an almost decent box. No down payment. VHS tapes Power don't shot. exist anymore. That's eight bucks. Five bucks. Five, five, 15. We're looking at least 30 bucks in this box. Not bad. We're getting there, ladies and gentlemen. Shoes. It looks like taxes. <laughs> Lord, it hurts. It hurts. To be right? Yeah. <laughs> making something so ugly and making it oh so pretty. What's that from? White Man Can't Jump. White Man Can't Jump. One of my favorite movies. You say that about every movie. You know how many favorite movies I have? All of them. Of more than two. Come on. Uh -huh. The American dream. Realize. This is everything I'm working for right here. This is everything that I embody. The American dream. Realize. I'm in the pursuit of it. We're about to make it happen. One way or another. Against all odds. That is the American dream. Got some Yo. pens in there? 
Yeah. Hold on. Everybody stop. Michaela wants us to look at negative eight cents in pens. So this commercial break is brought to you by the Laterra Pen. Thank you for your business, the loan consultant. This commercial is brought to you by your dirty hands. Oh yeah, uh, work-related incident. Oh, that was pretty good, yeah. When you are in a certain frequency in the universe, the energy will come to you and it'll set, slowly send you everything you need to know, see, and think. And that truly just to me, pops out and every, didn't we? Another bag, of, another kilo. It's like the same box, it's actually made party boxes. Um, are those red solo cups clean? Yeah, but we already have enough of those at home. Cool. That is a keep. This is oh. the Harlem Globetrotters, isn't it? Special K. Special K. Who is Special K? Anybody out there know who Special K is? Number 43. I am not exactly we most sports oriented. Ball. Yeah, that's, that's very, we could put limited edition on anything. Taxes. Taxes. This right here is nice. What is this? What is it? Oh, cool. it's a Grambling University college jacket. It's a Letterman. Yeah, it's a Letterman. This is some money right here. Quality leather. Feel it. Everybody feel it. Quality leather. Feel it, y'all. eBay. It's going home with you and Michael. What else we have in here? Ooh, we got another one. An undercoat. Ooh, we got a we got a set now. Now we have. A eBay set. Looks kind of nice. Looks quality. What's the label say? Can you read it, everybody? Official award sweater Bristol products. 100%. Nice. 100% going on eBay. Acrylic. What else do we got here? I think that this might just be a whole lot of stuff for Grambling. Look at this. Mm -hmm. This is an eBay box, maybe. Are those for the Pittsburgh pants? I don't know. No. Pittsburgh is in blue, they're orange. We'll have to look these up and see if this is Grambling University or not. But obviously, obviously those two pieces were. I think a million dollars would fit. What do we got? Oh. eBay. Mm, I wouldn't eBay. We can, we can. But slow down, Michael. We got to make money. We'll take it to the market. Find some gold. Motorcycle alarm. That's the eBay man. What do we got here? Multiple. Cyclop, cycle alarm, bike pal, quorum. There's like a couple eBay items here. Sure what they are looks like another they look all new cool. so we'll we'll see what these are worth on ebay we'll see if they're able to sell if not they'll just go to the market my handy dandy ebay team will do it expensive though because of quorum and the, just the box it seems like a really inexpensive item grambling university bag see everything black and yellow now to me looks like grambling university Ooh. We have here. Here's blue and yellow, but yeah. Oh. Do not let it touch the floor. Grambling State University, Northern California Alumni Associates. That is a big banner. Somebody out there is going to want this. I have no idea what I could sell this for. It's very quality material, good stitching, actual patches. This right here is large. This right here is probably worth something. If anybody out there knows anything about college related items, an alumni is gonna want it, but that's kind of cool. We'll put it on eBay. Drugs, ladies and gentlemen, he took drugs. Looks like they're a type of penicillin or something. Personal trash. Four dollars in channel locks there. Twenty dollar nightstand. Personal. 
quartz when I was looking for one of these quarter rolls the other day. <laughs> I think you should keep. Oh, they're only nickels. Dirt rails. Cards. I don't know what to say about this stuff. I wouldn't just go around recommending people buy units like this if you're if you're not into working and just making a few bucks without uh, everything being glitz and glamour. This is not the type of unit you normally want to buy. I am a gambling man. I like to the risk, the intent. There could have been something good in here. We're still not done, but as you start to go through a unit, you start to <clears throat> piece the puzzle together. What? I was hoping to do like priceless photos, but it's just ring folders for the file cabinet. Oh, trophies. 25th annual Skyline basketball team. This bag right here intrigues me. Coca-Cola Barcelona 92 1988 tube. Somebody might have been in the Olympics. Somebody played possibly in the Olympics of some form. I don't know what is this football gear. Yeah. Do they have football in the Olympics? I don't think so. I don't know. I'm That's how uh, clueless I am sometimes with sports and the world. But this is an official Barcelona game bag. That could have value, girl. Hmm. De La Salle. Cowley. Wonder who that is. De La Salle. I think the kid played and the father might have coached. For De La Salle? For whatever, because there's pictures of a kid and father. Okay, That's what well, the personal paperwork is. We'll go look into that. Possibly this is, yep. See, the kid keeps showing up. Prince Plus, so they had a little side gig doing Prince. Back to our positive affirmations of the day. Once opportunity knocks, it's always wise to have a team when i first met alex he taught me to, that teamwork makes the dream work and teamwork works in many different ways but i tell you right here this is powerful teamwork makes the dream work one of the most prosperous things you could do in life is have an imagination you always want to have an imagination because when times are tough you need to be able to see crystal clear the possibility of opportunity much like a fairy tale even and imagination says everything in there some men see things as they are and say why i dream things that never were and say why not a flipping men i like that i like that whoo and i love this so much oh my i love a good challenge anybody out there who's scared of adversity when things are tough when things are low when the world's against you when you don't think something's possible like I love a good challenge I swear on everything I'm up against challenges in every day of my life and I take them head-on you know with my heart with my business with my children with life they can do all because they think they can thoughts become things with imagination you can make anything happen. A good mindset, a good uh, mastermind, teamwork, all your imaginations are on the same power. Anything's possible. Look right here. This could have a half a million dollars and we could be sitting right here this close to half a million dollars. Don't know if it's in there. Don't know if it's not. But every storage unit is like that. It's like a box of chocolate. You never know what you're going to get. You just never know. That's all I can say. So, me and you, Salt Princess, Storage Auction Pirate. Teamwork, sitting out here in this $50 unit trying to get our life back together as a team. All these signs that are coming to us right here as we're doing this unit. It's everything that I preach to you coming to fruition. Ooh, Victoria's Secret bag. What we is like the, those things. Victoria, tell me a secret, please. Please tell me a secret, Victoria. I'm not a good person. No, this, they're, they're this Victoria's secret. I'm probably not a good person to tell a secret to because I... Uh, He'll tell everyone. Yeah, I'm telling... <laughs> you heard be like, you walk up to me like I'm gonna tell you something, but don't tell anybody. I'm probably best to walk. He's already away. texting yeah. somebody what I'm you're already, saying. It's probably on being recorded. I'm probably about to put it on YouTube. Just saying, I have a hard time keeping my mouth shut. I wish these people were a Cowboys fan. I'm so glad they're not. Wind chill. 
Bite the wind. I could see Uncle Michael maniac in that. You know, Uncle Michael always wears those funny shirts. Mm -hmm. Once again, shout out to Uncle Michael for wearing funny shirts. Okay. We're yet to find that million dollar dream in here. Mm. Don't forget, we still have that lockbox. The last thing we're going to open up. Don't forget to stay tuned for that lockbox that we, nobody saw. Can you imagine? Can you imagine just for one minute? That we opened that up and there was, let's just say, we don't have to say half. Let's just say we opened up and there's $62,467 in there. And what would you do? What would you do right now if we just opened that up and there was like that much money in there? I don't know. I think you should just leave all the stuff here and we should go home. <laughs> leave the deposit? <laughs> you know dad would never do that. You won't know until you open it all and go through it. It's personal paperwork. No money orders. No cashier's checks. Late charges on his truck. I know all about that. Sorry, guy. <coughs> I'm with you, buddy. It's not a Louis. Oh, we're doing good, though. I've been telling you guys a lot about this lady. Silica is very rare. Silica, see, it, it, it's so rare they tell you do not throw it away and do not eat it because every time you do, it's less and less silica in the world. So when you find silica, save it. It's very valuable. Um, I'm pretty sure there's a different reason for that. Baby girl, where's your imagination? Imagination. Hold on, team, we break huddle. We're going to do the Route 77 Red RG3. And what we're going to do is we're going to break you're going to run all the paper, put it in the truck. I'm going to take the big stuff. I'm going to put it in the front of the trailer. We're going to load everything. We're going to get a deposit. We're going to get the hell up out of here because this unit is turning out to not be one of my favorite units. <laughs> and ready to go. I did not get a chance to do this at the facility because I rushed out of there and I wanted to do this right before I left. The box obviously had the tapes coming off of it right here. You can see the dust. This wasn't even in the photo. It was right in the front, as I said, but now we get to see what's in it. And it was raffle stuff. They were doing fundraisers. That makes total sense. They had a football team they were working with. Nice. So much for that. That unit was all bad in all the wrong ways. Uh, even the negative energy that transpired for that unit taught me that that was not the uh, storage unit for me. This is exactly what storage units are like. Storage units are like raffle tickets. You buy a storage unit, you never know what you're gonna get. You might get nothing. You might get a something, you might get a gold mine, you might get a big old bag of poop emojis. Fact is, no matter how many storage units you buy, where you buy them, what logic you use to buy a storage unit, you never know what's in there. I say this often, my worst unit ever I bought loss-wise was 5,600. It was a whole eight by 48 container of brand new stuff that I can only sell $108 out of. And I was sold on it all in because it was new stuff and I profiled it that way. And that is the, the edge that you dance in this business. It's like a raffle ticket. So valuable lesson learned in that storage unit. They're like raffle tickets. That's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system. It's simply how we've existed. I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians and choose to be an accountant because it's safe in a business.